Hi guys, I hope you're right, I hope you're all well. So this video is a DIY tutorial on how I cut and style my pixie wig. The previous video that I made was basically how I made the pixie wig. So just in case, if you did miss it or you want a tutorial, do click the screen now and it shall direct you to that video on how I actually made the pixie wig, which is really easy. So first of all I start by combing the hair, making sure it's nice and flat and every hair is in place. Then I part away a sideburn, you know I love my sideburns. And then I start chopping away the hair with a blade comb. Do be very careful with the blade comb because it can be really, really sharp and you do not want to chop yourself or cut yourself by accident. So you simply just carry on chopping away, depending on how short you want it, would obviously determine how much you cut. So evidently the back part is now shorter than the other parts of the hair. So what I'm going to do is just part the hair and carry on chopping away or cutting away the hair with the razor comb. So evidently you can see the back part is really short compared to the rest now and what I'm going to do is just start parting the hair into sections and basically going to carry on chopping away the hair. Since I don't want the top part of my hair to be too short, I use basically a pair of scissors to cut and trim the longer parts and I carry on using the blade comb for the more shorter parts of the hair. I simply repeat the same process with the front section of the hair, however I do not cut it as short as I did with the back section. Also this is all down to preference and how long you want your swoop to look. So you simply carry on cutting away to your desired length. If I didn't point out already, this mannequin is quite small, so the hair is not going to fall in the middle of my nose, it's going to be on my forehead. So for security, you need to add some clips or some combs so that your wig does not get snatched by the wind girl. And then after that, I basically straightened the hair and I wrapped it overnight and it ended up looking like this. And this is how it looks like once popped on. So thank you guys for watching. As always, do thumbs up if you found this helpful. Also do subscribe to my channel, Liz Liz Life, for more videos. And lastly, if you would like one of these wigs made for you, I'm now taking orders. So do email me at lizlizlife at hotmail.co.uk. See you guys later. Bye.